Hi, my name's Aiden Ksaitis and I'm the global creative artist at Seb Man. So what are we going to do to your head today? So, I just want the length to be the same and just kind of like thin it out, just make it like... So just de-bulk it a bit, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Alright, cool. So what I'll do with you today is I'll just take rough sections off the top and just slice all those little dead ends and fluffy ends, yeah? And you'll conserve as much of the length, we will de-bulk it and really take it in and help you grow it out too. Perfect. Yeah? Yes, absolutely. Alright man, come on through, let's grow the basin. With Denny, I prep the hair using the purist and then I use the smoother as a conditioner, which is just going to tame it down a little bit afterwards. Once I combed out all the hair, I took a section from just at the point of the eyebrow to the crown. And I combed all that up. Once combed up, everything in front of the ear, I combed forward as I didn't want to touch that just yet. Starting at the back, I took an uneven zigzag section. What this does, it reduces weight at the back of Danny's head. I held out the hair at a 90 degree angle and I kept my scissors at a 45 degree angle. And I gently cut once, twice, three times down the length of the hair. As I went down the head, I made the zigzag section smaller as I want to focus on taking the bulk out of the top and less so on the bottom of the nape. Once I feel the hair is debulked enough, I drop the top section. So I combed out the hair and then I very generously applied the groom to the mid lengths and ends. And I really focus on those ends because his hair is quite damaged. And then I use the booster on the roots using the nozzle to section for me. I use the blow dryer on a very low heat and I gently scrunch the hair to create some natural fall and also doing my best to reduce as much volume as I can. Once dry, I took very rough sections at the ends of the hair and then I glided my feather blade to reduce the frizziness and just reduce the volume. Then again, I use the feather blade in a pen motion to even out the ends. This just gives a little shape while keeping the texture and not getting rid of the disheveled feel too much. I then spread the joker through the lengths to create a matte and textured feel as I know Denny likes his hair feeling like it's the morning after. Wake up, buddy. Ow! So good.